In this example, we will be approximating the square root of 94 to the nearest tenths place decimal. To do this, we need to look at perfect squares nearby to 94. Examples of this include 9 squared, which is 81, and 10 squared, which is 100. We can see that 94 falls between 81 and 100. So we can write the following inequality. 81 is less than 94, which is less than 100. Now we can take the square root of all of these values. The square root of 81 is 9 because 9 squared is 81. The square root of 100 is 10 because 10 squared is 100. Now we can see that the square root of 94 lies between 9 and 10. However, 94 is closer to 100 than it is to 81. So the square root of 94 will be closer to 10 than it is to 9. So let's pick a tenths place decimal closer to 10, such as 9.7. And let's see what 9.7 squared is and if it's close to 94. 7 times 7 is 49, carry the 4. 9 times 7 is 63, plus 4 is 67. Add our 0. 9 times 7 is 63, carry the 6, and then 9 times 9 is 81, plus 6 is 87. Now we need to add these values together. We get 94.09, which we can approximate to 94. We can then say that 9.7 squared is approximately 94. Taking the square root of both sides will allow us to cancel the squared and the square root for the 9.7. We can then write that 9.7 is approximately the square root of 94. This will be our estimated answer.